try to squeeze it in and put it in there. Stinker Store Scott Cup 2024, a uh, big two day show for the Speed Tour Sprint Cars. But another highlight and uh, really a staple down here at Magic Valley Speedway is the NASCAR Northwest Tour Truck Series. Um, John, this is uh, this is home for you. You've got a lot of laps at this place. Tell us a little bit about it, the growth, and uh, how your season's been here behind the middle of the truck this year. Well, uh, season's been good. We got seven wins in this truck. This is our Jeff Wade and I own this truck. It's our rental truck, so we actually usually rent this. And right. It's usually rented for the whole season to one person. But uh, I was really surprised. Just, we didn't have anybody wanting to ink up this year, so I decided to drive it. Uh, we got seven wins, and yeah, this is my home track, but I gotta be honest with you, this is my hardest track to win at. This, this track with these trucks, there's so momentum, momentum that, that you just have a really, really hard time getting past somebody here. But, uh, uh, but we still won here this year. We won several in Meridian, some new with that new track at Emmett. Yep. Um, so we got, you know, we still got half the races left this year. We had no intentions of running for points by all means, but if somebody doesn't sign up for the rest of the year, we're just gonna keep it out here and, Keep burning tires on Keep going around. Yeah. And being, you know, like I said, you got a lot of laps and everything here at Magic Valley. Um, big two day show, don't get a whole lot of these down here. Um, what's it like for, you know, you guys that have really brought this place to what it is to see some of these bigger shows roll in finally? Well, we love racing with the big with the big shows. And of course, here where we don't have a time constraint, that makes it really nice that we don't get our shows cut. But uh, where we run a double uh, 35 lot main events, it makes it nice for us. All of us guys like watching the sprint cars, uh, especially the league sprint cars. And uh, so, like I said, I think this is the first time in years we've had a double night in Twin Falls. Right. Every year we've had them at Meridian, and we really enjoy that. And I think later on in the year for the 208, we're going to have a Meridian again. Yeah. So, um, but we love the big shows, and uh, usually it brings out a lot of cars. But I think this Friday show kind of kinked a few guys. We've been having you know 14 trucks show up every race, and I think we're going to have a short field today. Tomorrow, I think we're going to have a little bigger field with trucks and stuff. But we've been averaging you know 13 trucks a race, and uh, fortunately, I just think you know, a lot of guys are having uh, time getting here. Right. Well, for you guys personally, I mean, it's great to see the trucks. They're still flying around. The truck. So we'll help you guys out, um, your program, and like I said, we're running for points, but you're right there as we get the second. Yeah, we are. We're real close. I think we're leading the points here in second or third in Meridian, but our overall should be close because uh, we're running for three championships. Exactly. Uh, 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 Division three here, Division three in Meridian, and overall. Um, but yeah, I got to thank Brian Helm. He's actually not even here today. So my little nephew, Bo, he's actually going to spot for me. He's never spotted for me. So this truck is him and I today, and that's it. Rob Best, who also works for me, he helps Jeff Wade. So he's going to try to help out if we need anything. But the trucks are really low maintenance. Uh, if we get a flat tire, I think everybody will hit you and stuff. But uh, Brian's been a staple with me for since 1995. And uh, I'm sure he's sick that he had to go to a family reunion by all means. But uh, right. he's, he's going to, I told him to get rested up because next week we got the, uh, the Idaho 200 in uh, Post Falls. Post Falls, yeah, right? That's, that's a 200 lapper, and I guess they got like 60 entries and they're taking 24. So it's going to be a big show. Yeah, we're going to run one of Trevor Cristiani's uh, late models up there at Pro Late. Nice. And uh, hopefully we make the show. So we'll see what happens. A lot of racing yet to go. Yeah. Um, so yeah, Magic Valley Speedway, the big two day show. And it's guys like this and these race teams that have kept this place up and running so we can put this thing together courtesy of my friends at Stinker Stores in 2020.